Hey gang, it is Camp Cowboy here with another video. I was asked to go ahead and do a video on wonders, and not just the main wonders, but temporary wonders. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all how to buy a wonder. So when you go to your little picture on the top left, and you, you know click on the empty temporary wonder, usually there will be some specials here on the right hand side, but just go to the store, pick out what you want, and you just got to buy it for gold. So drill drums, training speed, that's great if you're going to be training a lot of troops or if you get killed in KVK and need to rebuild. Architect's compass, so this will give you some construction speed, perfect if you're um, doing a lot of um, killing, wait, no, building, yes, ha, got sidetracked there. Storage protection, never a good idea. Uh, research speed, again, if you're doing a lot of research. Commander's horn. I like to match this up as well with a Hellfire hand cannon as well um, if you want to boost your march capacity and your uh, attacking stuff, um, your attack abilities. Do this a lot with the Kingdom Threat um, just about any time that I have to attack. Um, any time that it matters to attack, I will match both of these up, but the air cannon is much better because that will give you dragon abilities at home. Smoke screen bomb, it's really actually just a bad idea all in general because it will allow you to get killed first and then it will shield before after you get killed. Um, so I would prefer if you just shielded all outright. Airship beacon, also a terrible idea because it just gives you the dragon ability part of that air cannon without giving you any actual benefits to it. That is general gist of your temporary wonders. Now with temporary wonders, I don't have any, I don't plan on buying any right now. But it's the same mechanic as your as normal wonders. So right now I have my assault cannon equipped. Let's say I want to switch to cloak of secrecy. You just got to go in, replace it, and it's set. Um, so that's how you would use temporary wonders. Um, so like with the march capacity, what I'll do is I'll have my march capacity temporary wonder set prior to my march. So let's say this is my temporary one, uh, my march capacity. I will attack. Let's say this is my attack. And then what I will do is I will come back and after, before my march lands, I will switch back to my air cannon and I will let that march hit. And now while this is happening, let's go ahead and send a bunch of my resources away. Um, yeah, so that is basically a general idea of how to utilize your temporary wonders. Uh, I hope this video helped some of you that might have some questions on that. Thank you all for watching. This is Cam Cowboy.